Hello guys, it is me, Dave from Dakota, back on my Sky Odyssey playthrough, and I finished out making the Violet Matter Collector, uh, we'll call it a star. I, those are all Violet Matter, including the relays on the inside. And I created this little offshoot that will be used for Blood Magic. Um, I've been kind of pumping stuff into here, and takes a very long time using the chickens so what I want to do today is get a, a mob spawner I'm gonna use the RF tool spawner I think I know how to do this well I'm gonna figure it out I need to get the let's do this turn this off turn that off what are you You're interesting I want that Get it? I didn't. How do I get the blood from him? Oh, there we go. We got a little bit of blood. There's a little bit more. Okay, it's filling up. 30%. And I don't know where that little half slab went because I'm going to need it if a little baby zombie decides to come out. Turn this on. Nope. Come closer. Nope, he's dead. Crap. I'm trying to get more zombies. Baby zombies are the worst. And I need to find that block again. Oh, it should be right there. Nice. Okay. Okay. Let's let's do this again. There's the zombie. percent that's good almost full 90 percent there it is 100 percent okay and there we go that'll keep killing perfect all right so zombie syringe 100 percent uh, the next thing I'm going to look at, too, is my mystical agriculture, so I'll be messing around with that. I, I've kind of piled up all of the Infernium Essence I have. This will be burned through so quickly that I want to get more and more, and I can't EMC this, which sucks. So, I'm either going to make the mystical agriculture, um, like the, the Infernium seed, and just let that run and have like a planter doing what it needs to do or just leave my mob farm going for like a day and see what happens so we need the spawner now machine frame do we have those made over here not the same machine frame spawner machine frame oh this one has nope different machine different machine frame all right oh i don't have a blaze rod Crap. Oh, that sets everything back. That sets everything back. How can I make this? There's an, a magical way of making this? That would be great. Nope. All right, I'm gonna have to find a blaze rod. I have 42 levels. All right, let me find a blaze rod. 
and I will be back in a minute. Okay, so change of pace here. I'm going to set it up so I have a mini mob tower pushing all of the mobs onto that so I can kind of just stand off on the side and kill them. And to do that, I'm going to use the drop of evil because to get the, the blaze chicken, the blaze ron, it's going to take a little while. I, I went to the nether using the nether portal and put down some spawning ground, but I'm, I'm not over there waiting for it to spawn. So. Uh, I'm use these vector plates. We need stone, sugar, slime. So this will be. That'll have to wait. Stone. Sugar, which we have now, finally. Iron, I think I said, right? Yep. One, two of these. And a slime. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to place these on top of. Boom. Let's go with vector. What's your vector? What's your vector, vector? What's your vector, vector? Dirt. Let's. Get the stone that I like. I have been using. Now these are gonna push the mobs where I need them to go automatically. I'm gonna make a like a small mob spawning area and just have to deal with the possibility that some annoying little guys might show up. But this will allow me to get blood a lot quicker. So let's do this. So this is what I was doing before. I was just kind of like putting chickens in there and, and then killing them. What I'm going to do now is we're going to go up. I should. What I should do is I should rig this. Oh, that's what. That's what I'm going to do. That'll be so fun. I'm going to rig this bridge on the underside with dynamite so in case this starts going crazy I can just run over flip a switch and blow up the bridge uh, and be safe so we're gonna do this here okay Let's do a small one here and I should I'm gonna rig the bottom of this too one two three one two three one two so hopefully this is a big enough spawning pad. I think it should be. Hopefully I don't get any any stupid um, spiders. Spiders ruin everything because they're a weird size. Alright, so let's do this. <clears throat> that for now. I don't think it matters. I haven't actually seen anything but passive mobs spawn spawn um, on my area, even though I put down torches anyway, but let's go one, two. We're going to need more stone blocks, obviously. Let's go get some. Oh, no, I don't have to go. I always forget that I'm carrying a I'm carrying a, a tablet with me. We're gonna have a couple more stacks, that should be fine. So I'm gonna put down the drop of evil to make that all the spawning soil and then I'm gonna put the and I'm gonna make this only too high so only so I don't get any any issues with uh, Enderman warping around and stealing stuff. I think that's what I did with those as well. I need to make that look better too because it looks like crap. And what I'm 
I'm going to want to do is have a way to stop this. Like, um, have a door here. So let's get a piston. Let's get slime. Let's make this a sticky piston. Let's teach it. Two of those. Um, I don't think I need redstone. I probably need some of that and some of that. Way more than necessary, but that's fine. A lever. That'll be so I can just I can put a door here and stop the spawning from happening from down below. Well, not stop the spawning, but stop stuff from pouring out of it. So, I, so like if it starts to get out of control, I can rain it back. Uh, let's see here. This is gonna be. I think these set down this way. Yep. Boom. Perfect. So that's going to go bop, and it's just going to go boop. Actually, I don't need that. Because there's going to be um, the vector plate there. So let's look at this. on there. Bop. We're going to bring this signal up. That's not what I wanted to happen at all. <laughs> Let's see. What did that do? Okay, it grabbed it. And it should have pulled it back. Perfect! Let's get rid of this. this. I don't need any of that stuff there now. So if I go like this, Stuff will stop coming out. If we go like that, it'll pull it back. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Let's make this a little bit better of a funnel. So I don't want any mistakes to happen here. I'm probably going to have to get up here and clean this out every once in a while because it probably will get clogged but that's fine so now let's get the drop of evil Look at that, 126,000. That's nice. And I'm going to just do that right there. So this is going to... I don't know how these face. Okay. So they go that way. Okay. That's fine. Go this way. way. It's just going to push them all out the door and then down that. Now the drop of evil, this is where it gets dangerous. So 
So that's all under control. And it'll drop down there. Let's close this up. Pop that out. That should start the spawning. Oh, and the first thing we get is a stupid um, biter. Okay, so the first thing popped down. Probably gonna want this to be like that. And then I would just sit here and one shot him. And then that would fill up that. Look at that. I am automated mob killing. Let's close this. So now the half slab prevents the little guys from running out. I'm going to have to get some sort of hopper up here to catch all the drops. So let's push them all down there and I just stay in here and go bop, bop, bop. Perfect. Check that. And we're just pumping bloody fences into it. Awesome, 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 awesome. So what I will do is spend a little bit of time here getting this up to 50, get that achievement done or that quest done, and as well get a, a item collection going down here so it's a little bit on, more under control. And then what I'll end up doing is probably making a, you know what I should have done is I should have just set this up on a separate island and then... Maybe I'll do that. I don't know. I'm going to make the escape measures as well. Oh, look at this. I can just go like this and get rid of all the stuff I don't need. Perfect. I should have put this on a separate island. Um, but what I can do is I can make runes that allow for more blood to be created with every kill. Look at that. One shot. Get rid of them. All the blood are belong to us. Amazing. And that's going to fill up. I just had to figure out a way to um, get that to pull the blood faster. Because I don't know what this tops out at. But this needs to go quicker than what this guy is providing. So, awesome. That is a thing. Like I said, I'm going to put TNT underneath this. So in case something happens where I get lose control and stuff starts running, I can run out of here, flick a button or a, uh, a lever, and it'll blow up this bridge so that they're not connected to my main island, and then I can deal with just trying to get rid of them from from the safety of my main island. So that's going to be a thing. Uh, let me know what you're working on in the comment section. Now let, me see, let me know how far into the EMC you've gotten, and what quests you're working on and what quests you think I should start working on. Like I said, I am going to start working on more of the fluid expertise. I need to get these things going, like gasoline. I just it's just a matter of getting stuff set up. So that might be part of the next episode where I start getting a lot of those machines going. So like Resident Ender. Fifty buck fifty buckets of Resident Ender. What are we at? This has been running the whole time. Oh look at that. Let's see if this gets it. Is that not 50 buckets? Huh. Maybe I don't have 50 buckets. Maybe this is 112 millibuckets. Oh well. Oh, we're running out of power here. What's the problem here? Is this is full. Yeah, you're going. You've got power. Oh, this is all out of uh, coal. Wow. Hope they have more coal dust in there. Uh, this. This stuff is for, I believe, the gasoline. Believe that 
like this yeah this is for the grassoline so that's going it's just got to work its way through the pumpkins next in fact I'm just gonna get rid of all the wood because it doesn't need any more wood finish off that stack and then get to work on pumpkins perfect 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 let me know what you're working on what you want to see you working on next hopefully you're enjoying this series I'm definitely enjoying taping or recording this uh, this mod pack it is very fun uh, and next episode we'll probably go up to the next level of matter collector we're at mk7 let's move I'm gonna make a move for mk8 I'm gonna fill up that tankard full of life essence and start to make the blood magic uh, pyramid a lot bigger so come in check the next episode but like always guys good luck and have fun